All right, so uh, we're here in Boston for the Boston Venture and Angel Forums uh, organized by Capital Innovation. We have the pleasure to be with Rob Douglas, the president of Golden Triangle AngelNet based out of Waterloo in uh, Ontario, thank Canada. So thank you, for, uh, Rob, for making it all this way to uh, Boston to be here with us. It's something that we're really pleased to do. We're always interested in nurturing relationships in a cross-border fashion. We've had actually some direct involvement from Boston Harbor Angels who have uh, recently uh, put together a deal with a company called uh, eSight in, right. in Ottawa and uh, so we're, we're working that cross-border deal together. Yeah, so maybe we can uh, elaborate a bit about that. Uh, since we started doing uh, our events, we see uh, we do a lot of work with Boston Harbor Angel and uh, we were at the Toronto Venture Forum where Kevin from eSight was presenting Correct. and um, we, our goal is to uh, promote uh, cross-border investments, right? Yes. So, and uh, we are, we're seeing one happening right now and closing, uh, what, next week? We hope it's going to be next week. It's right. it's been very close for many days. So, so, uh, so can you can you tell us a bit more about like what what happens uh, in order uh, for those deals to happen? Uh, you know, cross border investment. Uh, what's the best practices? Well, I best practices. We we've got uh, fortunately a very strong partner here in uh, in Boston Harbor right. Angels, and particularly Bill McPhee, who has done many many hours of right. due diligence. Uh, once the company passed due diligence, then uh, there was a road show to, uh, to, to uh, show off uh, eSight to mm -hmm. companies uh, and, and angel networks in yep. Canada. And uh, so now we've got a number of investors in Canada working with Boston Harbor Angels and putting the deal together. Great. So um, do you think uh, the, the fact that another angel group, even though it was from a different country, did all the due diligence first, uh, that, that plays a lot in the process of uh, moving a deal forward? I think it's very helpful. Um, I think it's also worthy of note that uh, eSight presented to our group, Golden Triangle AngelNet, quite a long time ago. Oh, right. And we had some people who became involved in the due diligence process. And there were some things that needed to be done in order to kind of complete the deal. And it was really handed off in a certain respect to uh, Boston Harbor to do the heavy lifting. Yeah and uh, then our people were re-engaged and so it was a collaborative effort. Uh, it's not as though we did no due diligence but uh, really the heavy work was done here by Bill McPhee yeah. and we're really thankful for that. And you're really uh, one of the, 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 the best angel group, best organized in, uh, in Canada and uh, won many prizes and uh, I remember you uh, talking about how great you are in, uh, in Toronto, right? So uh, is there like um, uh, words of advice you would like to give uh, other investors, uh, especially angel groups, how to get organized and you know how to, uh, to move things forward? Well, I guess uh, in many respects it all has to do with the, uh, uh, the, just the personalities of the people involved yeah. in your angel group. We are very fortunate that we have people who are all really committed to uh, running an angel group as an economic development initiative for our particular area. They're dedicated to seeing early stage companies get a lift which will possibly move them onto a global stage. And uh, it's the people right. that, that really does it and their, their commitment and uh, the hours that they put in to uh, make it go, usually on a volunteer basis. So what's uh, uh, one of the, your success stories, uh, you know, like one of those, uh, those deals that make it all back with your investments? Well, you know, I, I've got to be very honest, our angel group has only been in business for three years right. and therefore all of our investments to date are money going into companies, not exits. So I can't brag about all the money that we've made on exiting deals. So it's, a, it's, a long, it's for the long run, right? Well, I won't say it's for the long run, but I'll say it's uh, definitely four or five years before we're going to see money turned around. Right. We are, are currently on the cusp of an exit for one yep. of our companies okay. and that will begin to cycle money and once money cycles then you've got something that has sustainability. Right. So uh, we're, we're, we're figuring we're pretty close. Wish you a lot of success with this. Thank you. And uh, as far as uh, you're, you've been an entrepreneur as well, right? Yeah. I've and then an you've been in, 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 for a in lifetime. In, in, <laughs> a lifetime. <laughs> and you've been in many fields, right? That is correct. So um, I think your background is very interesting. Maybe you can t tell us a bit about your background and how you came to be. Well, uh, very quickly, I'm a chartered accountant by profession, but uh, I only practice as a public accountant for a short period of time. I've also been a stockbroker. Uh, I've also been a controller for a public company. 
And then <clears throat> for the last uh, 30 years or so, I've owned and operated companies myself and become an angel investor sort of towards the end of my career. So mm -hmm. I've done a variety of things. I have some investments now, as I say, in angel, angel uh, companies and uh, act in a, an advisory capacity and, and sit on boards of directors. And so it's, it's a very fulfilling life. That's great. And uh, maybe to end up, uh, one last word of advice? One last word of advice. Well, I guess we would always say, and this is pretty common, uh, in the world of angel investment, you're investing in people, right. not necessarily the best uh, technology or, or, or the best process, but if you've got a good manager of, of a process or a technology, then it's going to be a winning situation. So always invest in the people. Great. Well, thank you so much, Rob. Thank you, Alex. Thank you.